Well, I think it's time we threw some more wood on that fire. Candy Springs? Boy, I bet there's a story behind that. You know it. It gives me chills just thinking about it. John, you got the chills because your foot's in the ice chest. Oh, uh, so I do. <laughs> now hand me that sign. It all started with the one daily ritual guaranteed to get kids out of their bunks. Your lanyard tying demonstration? No, not even that surefire crowd pleaser. I'm talking about the U.S. mail. Hey, everybody! The mail's coming! <laughs> huh? Yeah. Oh, ow. Gee, thanks for breaking my fall, John. Uh, anytime. Line up, you little runch! I don't have all day! Oof. It was going to be a long day. Uh, greetings, Mabel. Greetings, John. Vanessa, your parents turned down your request for a bigger allowance. Oh. Iggy, it's a letter from a medical company. Congratulations, you're the Pepto-Dismal poster boy. How about that? Lucky, here's your bone of the month selection. <laughs> Candy! Bills! 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 <laughs> and one more thing. John, you've been nominated for the Counselor of the Year Award. Must be a practical joke. <laughs> Give me that. Wow, it's true! I really have been nominated for the Counselor of the Year Award. Oh, wow! Well, yeah, I'm right. 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 And the award ceremony's in two days. In New York City! <laughs> Hot nails? Not so fast, Candy. I've got that award nailed. Get it? Nailed! See you in New York, Candy Man. Forget that macho meathead, John. We know you're gonna win. <laughs> Thanks, Robin. <laughs> Boy, this is exciting. Counselor of the Year. I better pack my things. Big Apple, here I come! <laughs> Before I left, Botch wanted me to do some shopping. Yeah, I mean, he got kinds of foods. As Botch was giving me his grocery list, Nurse Molly began her morning meditation. Let's see, uh, we got no bread. Yeah, no bread. Fresh out of dough? Yeah, no dough. <gasps> no dough? And we really could use some green stuff. Yeah, we need green stuff. No green stuff? Bread, dough, green stuff. Botch was talking about food. But Nurse Molly thought we were talking about money. Specifically, our camp funds. Oh, my goodness. Camp Candy must be going broke. No wonder we got all those bills. Oh. That night, Nurse Molly had the worst nightmare you could imagine. MTV got canceled? Worse than that, she dreamt Camp Candy went out of business. Oh, no, no bread. Oh, no dough. Oh, no green stuff. Oh, no, no. I've got to save the camp. But how? If you build it, they will come. A mysterious voice is talking to me. All right. Build what, oh mysterious voice? A health spa, you do it. It will be. Oh, of course! Oh, tourists will come from all over, and the camp will be saved! See ya, John. Bye, John. Good luck. So long, kids. Remember, Nurse Molly, you're in charge. I'll show you how to go So, Nurse Molly, what fun camp activity are we going to do first? Hiking? Swimming? Fishing? No, building, painting, and cleaning. Huh? Huh? Listen, kids, Camp Candy is out of money, and it may have to close. So, to raise some money, we're going to turn Camp Candy into Candy Springs, America's healthiest health spa. Health spa? Oh, that's great. I could use a facial. We'll never pull it off. We don't know anything about running a health spa. Don't worry, I do. And when we're through renovating, people will come from miles around to bask in our mineral waters, partake of our mud baths, and enjoy our fine vegetarian cuisine. 
mineral waters? Mud baths? Fine vegetable kerosene? Trust me. While Nurse Molly was turning my beloved camp into a new age tourist trap, I arrived in the Big Apple. Unfortunately, I was about to encounter one of the Big Apple's worms. Now to find a perfect sucker! <laughs> wow, those buildings are almost as tall as Widow's Peak! Excuse me, sucker! <clears throat> Excuse me, young man! Would you mind helping me across the street? Why, certainly, ma'am. What a friendly town! There once was a counselor named Candy. In New York, he wasn't too handy. A crook stole his cash, then made a mad dash, and the rest of this tale is a dandy. Yes? Candy's the name, counseling's the game. <laughs> Do you have my room ready? Yeah, I'm afraid you'll have to pay in advance. No problem. <laughs> I, I, I know it's here somewhere. Wait a second. <laughs> Excuse me. No problem. <laughs> A good camper is always prepared. <laughs> <clears throat> Excuse me, where does a fellow with no money stay in New York? Try Central Park. Gee, thanks. While I was looking for Central Park, the kids were turning my beloved camp into a health spa. Mud bath. Welcome to Candy Springs. That ought to attract some guests. Yep, Candy Springs was ready for guests, but were the guests ready for Candy Springs? Get ready, staff. Here come our first guests. So, what do you think? Cal Dump. I told you we should have gone to Rancho Rizzo. Don't worry, Mother. If we don't like it, we'll just sue the pants off of them. Central Park, proceed at your own risk. Oh, what is this, a joke? <laughs> Oh, this looks like a nice spot. Who would have thought that in the middle of this big city there'd be such a charming place to camp out? Oh, boy. I bet this poor Schlemiel gets robbed before sunrise. This should be a hoot. While I was camping out, Alex was about to give her first massage by the book. But Nurse Molly, I don't know the first thing about massage. It's easy, Alex. All you have to do is follow the instructions in my massage book. It's on the top shelf. I'll hold the step stool so you can get it. Well, okay. Shiatsu, the art of massage. Jujitsu, the art of self-defense. Make sure you take the right one. Okay. Excuse me, I'm ready to cool out with a nice relaxing massage. Well, I guess I'm ready if you are. Hiya! Hiya! Ow! Oh! 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 Ow! Look, it's the Big Dipper. Looks like he's relaxed now. 
Meanwhile, Robin had her hands full with sticky candy wrappers. In the tree on the right, you'll see a double-decker woodpecker, native to this area. A stupid bird, big deal. And I'd appreciate it if you'd give Mother Nature a little more respect by picking up your trash. Why should we, when you're doing such a fine job of it? <laughs> Boom. That does it, you polluting little pains in the neck. I'm sick and tired of picking up after you. Oh, yeah? What are you going to do about it? <laughs> Say, what kind of plan is that? Oh, that's just a giant Venus flytrap, but don't get too close. Just looks like a demo plant to me. Maybe that'll teach you some respect for nature. Hey, Venus, don't eat him. Just chew on him a little while. Hey, hey, slow. Ew, gross. We want service. We want service. Poor Iggy was about to do his lunchtime juggling act. Whoa! <laughs> Phew! Lunch and a serve! I've heard of eating like a pig. But this is ridiculous! I'm here for my mud bath. Would you mind helping me in? Help yourself, lady. I'm not getting near that icky mess. You want your tip, don't you? Okay, but it better be a big one. Yeah. <sighs> this is the worst experience of my young life. Stop playing footsie with me. I'm not playing footsie with you. I thought you were playing footsie with me. <laughs> well, something's squirming around down here. Something cold, slimy, and disgusting. <laughs> what did they expect to find in the mud canaries? Worms in the mud bath? What kind of establishment is this? I want that bath filled with fresh, clean mud, and I want it now. I'm so sorry. I'll get right on it. Yeah! This massaging is hard work. And picking up after those rotten brats is wearing me out. I know it's hard, but we've got to do it for the sake of the camp. Nurse Molly said we need to fill the tub with fresh mud. But what do we do with the old mud? Let's pull the drain plug. <laughs> Nurse Molly, this house bar business is making us sick. I'd rather go on a 20-mile hike without my blow dryer than spend one more day as a mud matron. You said it, girl. We want to go back to having fun. Oh, no. Look on the bright side, kids. In just a few minutes, our happy guests will check out. We want our money back, and I'm suing you for a zillion dollars. Make that two zillion. I still have worms in my hair. Money back! Money back! Money back! Money back! It looked like this health spa was going to send Camp Candy to an early grave. While Camp Candy was proving to be a flop as a health resort, I was waking up in the middle of my last resort, Central Park. Where am I? Where's my stuff? My clothes! But I can't find anything on an empty stomach. I'll just have to see what good old Mother Nature is serving for breakfast. <laughs> you know, let's see. <laughs> there ought to be some nuts up here somewhere. <sighs> Whoa! Uh-oh. Whoa! Oof! Whoa! Oof! <sighs> hey, this is more like it. <laughs> nice kitty. Nice kitty. <laughs> Please don't eat the camp counselor. <laughs> That's it. That's it. Quick. Quick, please. I need a ride. <laughs> Hi, this is Bob Costas interviewing Hob Nails, a strong contender to win the Counselor of the Year Award. Hob, 
Who do you think is your toughest competition? <laughs> Certainly not that tenderfoot John Candy. Speaking of Counselor Candy, isn't that him now, just ahead of that lion? Ah! Lion? <laughs> yeah! Camp counselor in his underwear being chased by a hungry lion. Extra, extra, wild man terrorizes Manhattan. Lion self story to Hollywood. For disturbing the peace and fraternizing with an endangered species, I sentence you to one night in jail. I'm innocent, I tell you, innocent. I'm an outdoorsy kind of guy, and the confinement was, you know, starting to get to me. Guard! Guard! I can't take it, I tell you! Let me out of here! I'm going star crazy! You gotta help me! I'm going nuts! Yeah? Ah, uh, nice cell you got here. May I, uh, <clears throat> please have a magazine? Good news, Candy! The governor called. You've been paroled! And we found your suitcase in a garbage pail. Phew! <laughs> Well, Candy, I hope your stay here has taught you a valuable lesson. What's that? Never run around New York in your underwear. Now get out of here! After stopping to buy a suitcase to replace my backpack, I finally got to the convention, and not a moment too soon. And the nominees for Camp Counselor of the Year are John Candy for Camp Candy, Hob Nails for Camp Kickboot, and... How can Candy even get nominated? It's a disgrace to the profession. <laughs> Of course, he doesn't have a chance against me. Money back! 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 Money! Nurse Molly to John! Nurse Molly to John! I need you! Nurse Molly to John! Nurse Molly to John! I need you! Nurse Molly to John! Nurse Molly to John! I need you! Nurse Molly! What's wrong? And how did you get on television? I used my new age crystal. John, I heard the camp was going broke, so I turned it into a health spa. But now, the guests are going to shut us down. Don't worry, Molly. I'm on my way. As much as I wanted to go to that convention, I had a job to do. Taxi! What? Wow, that's Snooky Carmichael, a famous movie star. <laughs> hey, excuse me, Miss Carmichael, but I believe that's my cab. Why, how inconsiderate of me. Of course it's your cab. Ow! SC. Oh, no! Miss Carmichael, you've got the wrong suitcase! Oh, well. Taxi! We are going to have this place condemned, and you and your staff will be thrown in jail. Does this mean you won't be recommending us to your friends? I needed a plan, and Snooky Carmichael's clothes were giving me one. Hi, uh, uh... Hello, everybody. Oh, Candy Springs, just as lovely as I remembered. <gasps> That's Snooky Carmichael. Gee, she looks different in person. <laughs> and maybe I was a bit hasty with that lawsuit. <laughs> Thanks for a swell time. <laughs> Oh, I just can't wait to dive into that divine mud bath and dine on that fine vegetarian cuisine. <laughs> <laughs> if if Snooky Carmichael likes the place, maybe it is good. Oh, Miss Carmichael, you saved the day. Come on, guys. Haven't you figured it out? <laughs> oh, Snooky Carmichael wears a wig. With our sign back in place and me out of Miss Carmichael's evening gown, Camp Candy was ready for business. The summer camp business. Mail's here. And there's a special delivery for you, Candy. The mail. Oh, that's what got us in this mess in the first place. Congratulations, you've won the Counselor of the Year Award. Oh, boy! Good night, yes, Well, Candy, I guess the only thing for me to say is congratulations. Thanks, Nails. It takes a real man to admit he's a loser. <laughs> I'll get you next year, Candy! 
As counselor of the year, my first official decree is to thank Nurse Molly for trying to help out. And my second official decree is everybody go have fun! Yay!